everyone, and today I'm showing you this, I believe it's a 98 Chrysler stereo. It's a Chrysler CD stereo. It's out of a Dodge Stratus, quite obviously by the mounts. I believe Stratus is the only one that had these mounts as the LHS, Dakotas, Rams, Neons, all had the same mounts, which were nice, compatible. It's kind of a shame how they had changed it for the Stratus, but anyway, that's beside the point. I snagged this out of a junkyard one. You can see it's a little dirty looking. I didn't really clean it up. I should have. Um, what did I do? Well, I mean, I guess I did. I tore open the insides. I cleaned the insides. I just never bothered getting the exterior cleaned up, so it's pretty nasty. But, uh, yeah, I tweaked the laser. And uh, I actually got the CD player to work. I cleaned the laser. I tweaked it as well. And, yeah, it's fully functional. There's no issues. Volume works fine. All the buttons work fine. The display works fine. Every everything. All these even glow. Sometimes I've heard that apparently these can like dim down. No, these work. But yeah, I'll admit I spent quite a bit of time rebuilding this radio. But honestly, if you want, considering you're watching this, just let me know. I'll probably end up selling this to you. Um, probably for a fair amount, but. Just make a little offer if you want, and I'll probably sell it. I mean, there's nothing wrong with it after I rebuilt it. Cleaned up everything in there, so you don't even have to worry about cleaning the laser. I know I'm not really showing you it works, but I don't have a test station, and it's dark outside. And besides, I don't feel like tearing the Infinity radio I got in my neon now. I found Infinity Radio in a junkyard LHS that somebody had rolled over like five times, it looked like. That thing was smashed on the roof, bad. But you could see it rolled over a few times, you could tell. It was it was not good, really not good. But anyway, Stratus was not rolled. I don't really need this radio, though. So you can just let me know. It also, unlike the uh, Infinity, which has some speaker port problems, this one doesn't. It works left or right rear, left rear. The doors, tweeters, they all work. Which is amazing. Glad to have those functioning. The tweeters. Um, unfortunately, the one I have in there now said the Infinity doesn't. The rest of the radios I've gotten before always had a working always had working audio. I'm not sure why the Infinity does. Probably has more solder joints. Anyway, there was nothing wrong with this one. All the speakers work when I tested it. Uh, all six of them. This thing turns on fine. All the buttons work. The CD player works. It was tweaked. I cleaned up the laser. Uh, and the exterior needs to be cleaned, but that's, that's it. So anyway, thanks for watching, and I'll catch you next time.